Hello and welcome back to my channel for another one of my uh, videos. I hope you've been enjoying the recent uh, batch of videos I've been doing. Obviously not as many gig logs as I usually do due to the fact that I've had uh, some knee surgery recently but we're very close to being back on to uh, um, gig logs in full steam very shortly with the full Christmas season that I've got booked ahead. But until that uh, I've got a few more videos for you and this week uh, what I'd like to do is share with you uh, my three DJ booths. I've done a little bit of a comparison, I've filmed some stuff before I went off uh, and had surgery and uh, effectively I've got three DJ booths myself. I've got one which I use for um, effectively bars and if I'm outdoors. I've got another one which is for compact setups and I've got my bigger one which I use for the weddings and bigger events. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you each one being set up um, to give you some measurements and dimensions on each one and uh, my thoughts on each one as we go through. Um, I hope you find them interesting. If you do, uh, don't forget to do that and uh, give us some interaction. Maybe drop a comment. Let us know um, are there any of these gig, are any of these DJ booths, booths that you use? Or uh, maybe uh, they might be um, one that you're considering getting. But uh, feel free to drop a, a comment in and let me know either way. So, as I say, I've got three uh, DJ booths that I'm uh, highlighting today. My first one is what we call a flight case DJ booth. It fly, folds down, it's like a flight case, uh, pops up very quickly. Um, and uh, as I say, I use that um, in bars and uh, outdoor events. Uh, the next one is my um, Equinox Combi booth, which is a, an easy, again, setup. Um, where I've got a bit of space shortage, can't put the bigger booth in, smaller setup, time restrictions on setup, that's where I would use this booth. Um, and then the third one is my uh, uh, Equinox uh, Trust booth, which is also sold as the ADJ event table um, under that brand as well. And that one's the one, one I use for my bigger weddings and bigger events. Um, but anyway, so hopefully um, you'll find this interesting. Uh, and if you do, please let me know. So without further ado, let's have a look at them. Okay, so the flight case um, dimensions are usable space width wise is 1 meter 38 centimeters, which is a great width. Depth wise, it's 44 centimeters, so not very deep, but still a usable space, especially if you put uh, a flight case uh, with your controller on, on top of it, uh, which I tend to do. And the height from the ground is a, is a very workable 94 centimetres. So all in all, a great uh, usable space and uh, an easy to set up uh, flight case booth. So this Equinox Combi booth, uh, which um, is proving to be pretty popular these days. Um, I know that my uh, video on this particular booth which goes in a lot more depth on that and I'll pop the link up there um, will be uh, of interest to many people but um, anyway the dimensions on the uh, combi booth there is it's a one meter uh, usable space um, I'm able to put my flight case on there still with my um, um, Pioneer XTJ RX in it, so that's nice and easy. Um, it's 50 centimeters deep, 
Um, so it does actually, the flight case does overhang slightly, but that's not an issue. Um, and it's uh, 94 centimeters high off the ground. So again, a very usable space. So this one is the Equinox Trust Booth and this uh, DJ booth is my favourite overall DJ booth. It's also called the ADJ Event Table under its other brand, um, but uh, it's solid, it's fab, um, it's a bit heavier, it is bigger, I mean width wise it's two meters and one centimeters wide so you've got loads of space. Uh, depth wise it is 60 centimeters deep um, so again that gives you a massive uh, tabletop area to uh, to utilize. Height wise it's 88 centimeters high so get a very usable height. Um, if you want to see a bit more about uh, this actually being set up and a bit more in depth um, there's a video link to a setup video I did that included this and um, uh, some other lighting and uh, and uh, fixtures um, but uh, well worth checking that video out. Um, all in all this is my favourite uh, DJ booth personally um, when I'm doing uh, bigger gigs um, because it because it is so sturdy. So um, I hope you found that useful.
So that's my three DJ booths. I hope you found this video interesting. And if you did, don't forget to drop a comment um, and let us know your thoughts. Um, if you uh, did enjoy the video, you could do one of these. If not, one of these. If you're not subscribed, don't forget to, don't forget to consider subscribing. If you do consider subscribing, turn on that bell. And until my next video, JP out.